Hi. Some of you may be wondering, what's this in front of me? Well, let's just say this is one of the biggest disappointments in my life. This is this. If you can see right here, this is a Mexican style lasagna. Now, you may be thinking, oh, Aaron, that's perfect for you. You love lasagna, that's one right there, and you're Mexican, so you must love Mexican food. People that think that you guys let you go in that one, that was a little racist, but I'll let you go because that's true. I do love Mexican food, and I am Mexican, but next time. Anyways, I had it yesterday. And, or half of that yesterday. Cooked it up. <sighs> now it looks even less appetizing. You can see right there, that's some, some a little water. It's kind of disgusting. So, you, me, you may be like, Mexican lasagna, what does that mean? And, you know what it means, right? <sighs> you take everything Mexican food, right? You take some beans, refried beans. Some ground beef, some Mexican cheeses, even some peppers. I think, yeah. Oh, and onions too. Okay, that's the Mexican part. What's the lasagna part? The lasagna part? You just take lasagna noodles and you shove them in there, and that's it. That's it. That's all that's in there. Take it, guys. Take a look. See, this is. You can see the noodles in there. I mean, Okay, it's kind of hard to show you. There's a layer of beans and cheese in there. In the picture, it looks like a nice layer of cheese. And it's mostly just beans on top of here. And if we start... It smells really bad, too. You can see there's more stuff in here. That's the little cheese layer. They just threw a bunch of sh crappy cheese. There's more layers. There's... Oh, it's falling apart. Oh, shoot. Okay, let's see. Yeah, it's just kind of... Oh, God. See, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Lasagna noodles in here. Lasagna noodles. Disgusting. These were so gross. A horrible combination. Um, <coughs> oh, God, that just made it gross. We could have made it... Wipe off my hands real quick. Well, kind of made it so much better, right? They just didn't do lasagna noodles. Just don't call it lasagna. Just throw in some tortillas. My boss was saying corn tortillas. I think chips. Any any sort of just call it a casserole. That's basically what this is. A shitty casserole. Oh man. Okay. Also, another thing. I I think this, I I. Don't, I can handle Taco Bell. Taco Bell does nothing to upset my stomach. It sits in here perfectly fine. Some people, some people, uh, it doesn't sit too well with them, you know. So, if I can handle Taco Bell, I can handle most shitty things. This, my stomach was not pleased about this, eating half of this. And, let me tell you, one I ate recently, not uh, recently, last year, I ate... <sighs> Lasagna for dinner, or not lasagna, lasagna, Italian food for dinner, seven days in a row. Uh, the Latin considered a lot of frozen foods, there's a whole, I have whole, anyways, frozen pizzas. My stomach started to not like it on day five. My stomach decided to, you know, uh, was not happy. This, this right here, this mess did what it took five days of frozen stuff to do to me and we just <sighs> getting, a little, getting a little annoyed here <sighs> let's just say I was very displeased I shouldn't even advertise this is freaking lasagna lasagna is good this is not good this is bad <sighs> I was just so dis I was very excited. I was, oh, I'll go to the store, buy this nice Mexican lasagna. Mmm, it'll be delicious. 
perfect, you know, perfect for me as somebody that loves lasagna, loves Mexican food. Individually, I love the things in here. I love beans. I love ground beef. I love cheese. I love noodles. I even love peppers. I even love onions. This also had no sauce, no spiciness, nothing. I haven't been gotten this worked up in three years. Three years right here. Three. Three years. I. Some people say, Aaron, we don't ever see you get that angry. That's because I don't get angry. This is the closest I've gotten to losing my cool in three years. Three goddamn years. <sighs> All today, throughout work, my stomach was just gurgling, gurgling, because I was really hungry last night. So I was like, I'll just make this really quick. Not doesn't take much work. It looks delicious. <sighs> Complete and utter disappointment. I don't know if you guys have ever experienced anything like this before, just where you had your hopes set so high, you were so excited to try something, to, 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 to accomplish something so great, you were looking for it so much, and then it turns into this, this right here. You know, it was just like all this other stuff going on in my life. And then, you know what? A little bit of hope shines through. Oh, this Mexican lasagna will make my day amazing, you know. I may be single. I may be lonely. I may be not doing so great in my classes, you know. I might not have any friends that I get to talk to that often. I have some friends, but, you know, I don't... If I go to the gym, if it's classes, the bright, shining through the brightest, the, the meals I get to have. You know, oh, that's just delicious meat I've been making. I made some amazing meat last week. Oh, delicious. Oh, I have some food cooking right now. It looks to be amazing. I'm so excited for it. Last night, oh man, so excited for this. And it's just everything fell flat. It's just okay. You know what they say. You gotta push through. Keep trying harder and harder. You go out there, grab it, and don't let go. Even no matter what life throws at you, you know. No matter if life throws at you. Complete and utter worthless food. I don't know, you guys know this. My food is... Uh, my <laughs> they go, they go, is that a Freudian slip? My life is very food-based. I'm going to school so I can get more money, so I can have a better kitchen to cook better food. <sighs> I think I'm going to go. <sighs> my frozen pizza is cooking. I had to get the head, get a good frozen pizza, good DiGiorno's. DiGiorno's not my favorite, but a second favorite. Get a good DiGiorno's, a good one, you know, a nice supreme. To make up for the taste of this disgusting filth. You know, this reminds me of... If was, you know, this reminds me of... Um, yeah, just... Oh, man. I don't even want to say... <laughs> 